hello everybody welcome back to the channel so I do have a very well not very small but I have a small haul for you um simply because I had some leftover from Christmas and I have a gaming app on my phone which eventually and I say eventually because it takes a long time uh, pays you out some vouchers for places like Amazon so I bought some books and stuff with them so that's why I've got stuff so I'm just going to show you very quickly what I've got so I've got some finer brushes um, because when Jennifer uses them she squishes them around and they just get wrecked so I thought I'd just buy them only £1.50 so for us to use um, I've got another sharpener with an eraser in it just because I want one in my bag when I'm out and about um, I got again for one around about these um, 36 Scribblicious current pencils from Rick, so not bad. I have been using them. Um, they were only three pounds, and they can sit in my handbag with a small coloring book. And then when I'm out, and someone, for instance, I was out with Paul on uh, uh, Tuesday. Went to the opticians. Um, I'm not going to sit around the opticians waiting for him, so I went into Starbucks. They had a cup of tea. I had uh, had a croissant. And I did a little bit of colouring. And it was very good. And I also got from TikTok shop these metallic colour pens. I've already got some of these. Um, I've used them a lot. But this one has 30 instead of like the 12 or 15 you normally get. So there's a lot more different shades of, say, blue, for instance, than there are in the other ones. They do have colour numbers and names, but they don't have them actually on the barrel. So that's not really a lot of use. <laughs> I usually test them before I do it. Um, the biggest supply I got this month was because Jennifer uses um, the markers from TikTok shop. So I did get the 168 set. I haven't swatched them or anything yet or sorted them. As you can see, they're still all mixed up. I will start sorting them out fairly shortly. Put all the blues, all the reds, all the oranges, all the greens, all the greys together. And then eventually I'll swatch them. But yeah, now these ones because there's so much they are sitting in a little tray at the bottom so they don't actually fall over when you take one out and I do believe yeah you can take the, them out in the four things if you wanted to take them out of the case but I'm going to leave them in there so that's all the supplies because as Paul says you don't need any more pens because he's actually right I'm trying I'm not using them yet I'm trying to get a load of the pens that we've partially used got rid of and I've actually used quite a lot this month I might even show you in my uh, wrap up video when I show you what I've coloured. So this month I finally picked up Small Victories by Johanna Basford. This will be probably one of the books that I stick in my bag because it's small. Get out when I'm out and about. That's that one. And the one I was colouring in is the Colour in Heaven Pockets Sized book this is the second one that they've done this is magic jars um i'm not going to be collecting these i just bought this one because i wanted something to color while i was in starbucks they are really cute so again it's going to be one of those magazines i pick up if i really like it so this month is the first month i don't have um a color in heaven special because i haven't bought it it's, it's jashley and while i like jashley that's the one i'm working on i've got a lot of jashley stuff that I haven't coloured in yet so I just can't justify buying it I've got too many books it would have to be something I really love I did however pick up this month's Relax With Art I might change my mind on Jashley before the end of the month I quite like that the makeup bag um, that's quite nice I do find these quite easy and nice to colour so there's that one and that one is an issue uh, 115 I got the Spooklets sketchbook by Carla Magana to add to my Carla collection. This is another small one, quite like this. It's not too big. So that's going to be quite a fun one. Again, I could keep it in my bag if I wanted to, or I don't know. I got the Quiet Town colouring book. This is one of the Jade Summers newer books. I haven't really looked at it yet. Quite like that. So there's that one. It shows you on the back. Now I thought I had cancelled all my pre-orders, but one managed to slip through, and it's Tales from Atlantis by Hannah Carlson. 
um, which obviously I do want because I love, I've got all of the books apart from Grains of Gold and I really like them. There's some really nice ones in here as well, like in all of her books. I like this one and those two. Really, really nice. I've got 50 Gorgeous Pattern Colour by Number by Sachin Sachdeva. These ones are really nice. I've started one in here as well. Yeah, really nice. So I like that one. Let's just play it back. Oh, Whimsical Worlds by Ava Brown because I haven't had an Ava Brown book for a while and I was looking at this one and it was really really cute so and I do like their books as well again they're a company like Jade Summer who uses a name um, <laughs> so cute that has different artists so but I, I like that that's a really 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 cute book I want to do one in there this month and I got uh, 50 Hearts to Colour by Camellia Angel Cova. Very nice. Valentine's Day next month, so I should probably do one or two in here. Definitely do one. Pinks, reds, golds, silvers. That's nice. And there's that one. And the last one I bought. See, I didn't buy too many. I had to get this one by Deborah Muller Cabaret pinups colouring book because I just love anything like this. It is absolutely fantastic. This might become a favourite very quickly because this is my my kind of thing, pinups and things, so <gasps> I love it. So uh, those are all the books and supplies I got in the month of January. There probably won't be another haul for a while because I'm not going out of my way to buy a lot. Um, I will do a few flip throughs. Um, if you're interested in one I don't do or one I haven't done, but you know I've got the book, let me know down in the comments below and I will certainly do a flip of any book I have for you. Um, but that is really it. So. I hope you've enjoyed this very quick video of things I've bought and I'll see you in the next one. Bye everyone.